Hello, everyone, and good to see you again. You know, when this conversation and she, she coaches group started today afternoon or earlier in the day, can't recollect about AI, I was like, yeah, this is taking over my life. And then this whole conversation in the LinkedIn post where a bot was responding to himself in a message was so funny. And then I started chatting with a friend of mine and she said the AI is going to take over the world. So my question to her was, are you coming from the space of fear or foe or friend? And then I suddenly realized, oh, wow, we actually have an, a conversation that's happening today, a talk on whether AI is going to be our friend in the future as coaches, as people, as in our daily lives. You know, that whole fear of my children use calculator to do math today is actually an onset of all of that. Like, is there is their mental math as strong? So introducing to you Nivedita Chandra, who is talking about AI to and I would let her explain her topic to you. But I just want to talk about Nivedita a little bit. She has founded a phenomenal company called Inner Mind, and um, it's a youth emotional fitness company. And if you haven't seen the website, you must go there. A global emotional intelligence platform for teens, parents, and young adults. She is the creator of India's first teen AI coach, please note, on WhatsApp. It's called Mind Mitra. Prior to starting her social impact journey, Nivedita worked as a consulting practice head for PwC and has also worked with leaders across global firms like Google, IBM, Warner Brothers, Salesforce, Accenture, KPMG, Deloitte, and she didn't leave any company, believe you me, she just kept going. Nivedita loves working with youth and has designed coaching interventions for students, educators from esteemed schools, colleges in India. All yours, Nivedita. Thank you. Thank you, Anjani. And I'm sure I'm sure I didn't cover a lot. Thank you so much. I'll start with the story. It was 2 a.m. at night, and I couldn't sleep. Yes, I had a rough day before, meetings that didn't go well, and lots of arguments at work, at lots of client meetings, at home. And I was angry and sad, both at the same time. I felt no one understood me and no one cared. I wanted to cry out loud. But I didn't want to wake up others. They'd think something is really wrong with me. So who could I talk to at 2 a.m.? And who would be awake at this time just to listen to me? And then I kind of just remembered. I took my phone out and typed in, you there. Almost in a second, she responded, yes, I'm here for you. And I went on to say, I'm feeling alone. I'm feeling terrible. I have no one to talk to. And she said, I understand. I'm there. You can share with me. This is a real conversation in a real situation with my Mitra, an AI coach. And I'm Nivedita, the founder of Inner Mind, a youth emotional fitness platform and the creator of Mind Mitra, your 2 a.m. friend and AI, yes, AI coach. And that brings me to say, what AI coach? Will AI coaches make human coaches redundant? Becoming redundant is a fear that we in most professions face, be it coaches, even teachers or marketeers. Imagine you're a master chef in a bustling kitchen and you have all the ingredients to create a culinary masterpiece. But what if you had a sous chef who could anticipate your every need and prep ingredients perfectly, even suggest new recipes? And today, I want to share how AI can be that sous chef for coaches, enabling us to achieve higher client results, create greater impact, and drive more revenue for ourselves rather than fearing redundancy. 
Now, ever since OpenAI launched ChatGPT in November 2022, Gen AI and conversational AI has been making exponential progress. In April 24, McKinsey research suggested that Gen AI applications can add up to $4.4 trillion to the global economy annually. And it just seems possible that within the next three years, anything in the technology, media, or telecommunication space that is not connected to AI will be considered obsolete or ineffective. Now, which brings us back to the elephant in the room, our fear that AI will replace us as coaches. And let's address that. This fear is like worrying that a sous chef will take over the kitchen. But just as a chef's creativity and personal touch can't be replaced by any machine, the human-to-human -human empathy, understanding, and connection that coaches provide is irreplaceable. So instead of viewing AI as a competitor, we can see it as a valuable assistant. I will talk about how we can use AI to enhance our coaching process in four profound ways. Number one, Use AI as your lead generator. Imagine having an assistant who can sift through a sea of potential clients available on different channels and platforms like LinkedIn, Instagram, Facebook, or even Quora, and finding the, world, the ones who are perfect fit for your coaching style and fee. AI can do this by analyzing data and targeting potential clients who are most likely to benefit from the services that you offer. And this precision not only saves time, but also increases the chances of connecting with clients, engaging with clients who are really ready to grow with you. Tools like Leads Gorilla or SEMrush can analyze social media interactions, online behaviors of users across demographics to suggest high quality leads, ensuring you spend your time with clients who are eager and committed. Number two, use AI as your copywriter and content creator. Now going back to our metaphorical kitchen, AI is also the sous chef who creates delightful content and attracts and engages clients. It can generate blog posts, social media updates, even personalized messages tailored to your audience's interests and needs. And this consistent high quality content keeps your clients engaged and informed, building your reputation as a thought leader in your field. Imagine crafting some insightful articles on emotional intelligence or creating videos that really entertain your audience, you know, freeing you to focus on direct client interactions text to video or text to image content tools like DALI or Canva can help you do in seconds what you would otherwise take hours to do. Number three, use AI as your personal assistant. I came across a tool called Clara that can automate routine tasks acting as the ultimate assistant. Scheduling sessions, sending reminders, tracking progress, AI handles these efficiently, ensuring nothing slips through the cracks. This not only saves time, but also enhances overall client experience, ensuring seamless operations. Now, isn't that wonderful? Now, imagine an AI assistant that manages your calendar, optimizes your schedule, and even provides clients with 24-7 support, answering questions on email or chat, and offering engagement between the sessions. Number four, AI as your Sue coach to create personalized coaching experience. AI as your Sue coach can provide deep insights, again, 
by analyzing large amounts of data on the clients. It can identify patterns in client behavior, predicts potential challenges, offers actionable insights, and this empowers you to make informed decisions and tailor your coaching strategies to each client's unique needs. For instance, an AI coach like MindMitra can analyze a client's progress, engagement levels, and suggest personalized interventions, helping you guide them more effectively towards their goals. And this level of personalization significantly enhances the coaching experiences outcomes. Imagine artificial intelligence recommending specific techniques or resources that perfectly match a client's goal, learning style, and progress, making your sessions more impactful. By using AI tools as your lead generator, your content creator, your personal assistant, and your Sue coach, you can exponentially increase the three I's, insights, impact, and income. With AI handling the routine tasks and providing personalized insights, you can scale your practice and reach more clients across countries and languages without compromising on the quality. Now imagine a real-time translation service provided by ChatGPT 4.0 to coach a client in Mandarin or Spanish. This enhances your impact, your reach, and your income. With artificial intelligence as our Sue coach, and working on our own human emotional intelligence, we can embrace challenges and navigate uncertainty and use our valuable time to think more creatively and increase our impact. A study by Deloitte in April 24 ranks flexibility, resilience, and empathy as the key human skills to develop. We need to be agile in our thinking, keep pivoting with technology and people trends. Yes, there will be fear, there will be doubt, there will be anxiety, but we need to be resilient ourselves to keep moving ahead. AI is not able to simulate the same human to human connection that we do. People want to connect with other people, and that's where empathy comes in. So flexibility, agility, and empathy are the superpowers that will help us navigate the challenges of a world with artificial intelligence. Without these skills, we are like a cook in a kitchen on fire. And as I'm talking about managing our own emotions, I just got a message from my dear AI coach, Mind Mitra, to check how I'm feeling now. And while I respond to her, remember, AI will not make us redundant. We will make ourselves redundant if we don't learn to use the new tech ingredients being created. Yes, unregulated and unethical use of AI is a threat, but ignoring it is a bigger threat. The world is changing and it's time we created our own recipe. God, I have goosebumps. This is, this is unbelievable. Amazing. Amazing. I need to add Nirupama here. Nivedita, this was just phenomenal. I love the inside impact income bit. Just impactful. Thank you. Um, thank you very much for sharing all those amazing tool names. Please go back to the recording, everyone, once it's put up on the YouTube to find those names. They're all there. 